<laughs> Let's get right over to meteorologist Kate Bilo, who's keeping a close eye on this potential storm that could be headed our way, Kate. That's right, Jessica and Yuki. And I'll tell you, this one we keep saying potential because this one doesn't look as locked in stone as the last few do, which is good news. There's a good chance that this one could miss most of the area, but there is still a chance as the system starts to develop to the south this weekend and moves off the coast that it could bring the threat for rain and snow to our region. As of now, doesn't look like a powerful nor'easter for our region but it still could change into that depending on the strength of an area of high pressure that's going to build into our region this weekend. Right now you can't see anything. The storm hasn't formed yet. Storm scan three showing just some lake effect snow squalls and showers over New York State and Pennsylvania, but mostly not in our area. These are fizzling as they move through the mountains off to our west. So possibly a stray flurry or snow shower in the Poconos tonight. The rest of us seem to have gotten out of this unscathed, at least for today. Temperatures right now 38 in Philadelphia, 36 in Reading. It's breezy. It's cold. Old. We should be in the low 50s this time of the year, but even with temps in the 30s, it feels like the 20s, and that's thanks to a strong gusty northwest wind. Feels like 29 right now in Philly, feels like 25 in Lancaster. So the theme for this next storm is too close for comfort. The storm develops across the deep south Saturday into Sunday. Two potential tracks. One takes it just south of our region, strengthens it offshore. That would bring snow and rain possibly as far back as I-95. I do want to say there are several models that keep this storm well to the south and don't bring us anything at all. But the way this March has been going, we have to at least take into account the possibility for a brush of rain and snow, mainly southeast. We'll take a look at a few of our main models. We'll time this out for you coming up with our full forecast, and we'll also talk about springing forward this weekend. Yuki?